Gentlemen, this is Coach K with the motivational tip of the day, Axe. That's right, Axe. Life has to be simple for you. You have to keep it simple. You have to keep it simple and not over, over complicating your thinking. A lot of times we think we have to struggle through life. Uh, we have to go through this to get to that. That's a certain mindset. That's a limited mindset. Um, you have to pay attention to the words. Uh, I'm not a religious person. I don't believe in a religion or anything like that. So, but at the same time, there are things that are there. There are things and there are answers to many things in our lives that we must pay attention to. Um, I have had a lot of success in my life recently. Well, really not recently, but ever since I changed this, ever since I had a renewed mind. And the main thing is, you know, before I had my renewed mind, I had all kinds of things going on that wasn't right and couldn't figure it out. Well, I'm lacking less money, running out of money. And, I mean, just a whole lot of slew of negative things. But I got tired of that. I got tired and I wanted better. I wanted to do better and I wanted to help more people. I wanted to help my family. And also, most of, most of all, I wanted to help myself. I wanted to become the better the best person or the best ver version of me that I can be. So I set out the journey to change this, to change me. And I can say truly today, I am changed because this. But the motivation tip of the day is, I wanna give y'all is easy, simple, just, it's, it's really simple, it's not that hard, but you gotta pay attention to it. And focus on it every single day. Read it and say it over and over again. Anything that you want to accomplish is in this verse. And it's a verse in the Bible. I'm not sure <clears throat> excuse me, what verse it is, but I'm telling you, it's powerful because these are the things that when I want to accomplish something or when I want to do something, whatever, those are the things that pop in my head or I would say. And the phrase goes like this. I would say, well, it's actually God. So it says, Acts and it shall be given to you. Seek and you shall find. Knock and the door shall be open to you. For those who ask it shall receive it. He that seeks it finds it. That's very powerful. Everything that you need is in those verses I just gave you. I'm going to say it again. But it's not going to be an order. Excuse me. <clears throat> Knock and the door shall be open to you. For those who ask it shall receive it. He that seeks it finds it. So pretty much what it's saying, whatever you ask for, you gotta be paying attention to all those clues up in, that, in those verses that I just gave you. Because I guarantee you, anything that you want, you say those things and pay attention to all the signs God, God gives you, you will get exactly what you want. But you gotta pay attention, you gotta be mindful. But you also, also too, gotta have, you also have to have a renewed mind. So remember, ask and it shall be given to you. Seek and you shall find. Knock and the door shall be open to you. For those who ask it shall receive it. He that seeks it finds it. All true statements. It will never lie. It will, it will always give you exactly what you want if you do those things right there. But anyway, this is Coach K signing off. I will elaborate more on that um, later on in another video. But I'm telling you that those words, those verses are very powerful. Knock and the door shall be open. Seek and you shall find it's your receiving he that seeks advice. It's not in the right order, whatever the case may be, but that's not the point. But the point is, the phrases and the verses I just gave you, put them in your life, make them count, it'll change your life. This is Coach K signing off. I have a super fantastic day.